Good evening. My name is Yong Xiang Xi. My master field research starts right here. Vanadium is an essential metal for human and other species, but excessive amount can cause toxic effects such as cancer to human or fish death. However, is the amount of vanadium the only factor to cause those effects? Not so. It also depends on the species of vanadium in the water, and that's what we call speciation. Small dissolved vanadium species like vanadium irons, they can pass through the cell membrane easily and cause toxic effects inside the cells, while large dissolved vanadium species like vanadium bound to the dissolved organic matter, they cannot really easily pass through those cell membranes so they are less toxic. Dissolved organic matter I mentioned is referred to the uh, organic molecules that dissolve in the water. My research is to look at how much of small and large dissolved vanadium species are actually in the natural water and whether dissolved organic matter has an influence on vanadium speciation. To achieve that, I chose Churchill as my study site. For one reason, Churchill is a pristine environment with only 800 local residents and minimal human interference so that I can look at uh, how vanadium behave in the natural water environment. On the other hand, Churchill has both viewers and estuaries so that I can look at the vanadium speciation in two different and representative water environments. The findings are fascinating. If you want to know more, you can read my thesis. <laughs> but two things I can mention. Uh, finding number one, small dissolved vanadium species uh, in estuary is five times higher than in estuary, while large dissolved vanadium species in estuary is 50 times higher than in river. The reason is probably because two different types, uh, two different types of environment, uh, the vanadium from sediment leaching are quite different. Finding number two, dissolved organic matter do regulate the vanadium speciation. The sites with higher amounts of dissolved organic matter, they have less amount of small dissolved vanadium species. In closing, I thank Dr. Gugon for research support and thank you all guys for listening.